Welcome. In front of me, I have the Redmi Pad 2, and I'll be showing you how you can record a screen on this device. So, to get started, we're going to swipe down from the top of our screen, which will bring down a bunch of toggles. And one of those toggles will be the screen recorder, which looks like this. It's the camera. You can tap on it. Now, first time around, it will bring up this uh, pop-up to allow it to send you notifications for some moronic reason. Even though I don't know what would need to send you notifications, it's a freaking screen recorder. Uh, but just know without actually giving it that permission, it won't work. So we do need to do that for some reason. Now from there, we can click on the red circle, which will begin recording. Now I'm opening up Netflix for a specific reason, which we will see in a second. Uh, I want to point out that I am not signed in, nor have I agreed to terms of service or use, nor did I even uh, d download this application myself. Uh, it just comes with a device. So. I'm pointing all of that because it's gonna be very apparent why in a second. Now once you're done recording, you can interact with this overlay right here, click on the square right there, and it will automatically save your screen recording to your photos application. So see how long it takes me to actually find it. Oh, that's not an app tray, that's a search bar. Oh, there we go. So we have gallery right here. Let's open that up. You can also close this by clicking on the X right there. And you can see we have our screen recorder right here at the front, but we can also navigate to albums. And in albums, you should have an album called screenshots and screen recordings. Click right here on the screen recordings, and there it is. And tap on it to view it from here. Now, what you will about to see is basically a function feature of Android where it blocks screen recorder from being able to see applications without your permission or even a knowledge. So there it is, Netflix being fully open. As you've seen it on a recording, it was visible there. And here, all I have is just a straight black screen. And there we go, it's, it's closed now. And everything is visible again in a recording. So it's something that Netflix does as a blatant intrusion on your privacy, I would say, considering they're altering how your device works without ever even asking for permission to do so. Uh, so it's kind of comical that they're fighting with piracy like this. So I recommend, you know, showing a middle finger to that because no one should be uh, disregarded with their own device and have the application decide what the, what you can do on your own device uh, like that. So for that reason, I recommend checking out CloudStream on GitHub. You can thank me later. Uh, but in any case, if you found this video helpful, uh, don't forget to smash like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.